was sharing the gospel. You're going to trust God that even if you have disappointed God, even if you have failed God before, you receive the grace to shine as light. That is the greatest privilege you have in this generation to shine as light. Hallelujah. I pray you will not be neutral in these affairs. I tell you, you will not just stand and watch us do some things for the Lord. I want you to be part of it, wherever you are. Hearing me, you can say, Lord, give me the strategies. Give me the inspiration. I just want to shine for you and you will be amazed. The, ty- the kind of things God will give you as strategies. God led me to write letters. I'll write it. I'll write so many letters. 13, 19 letters. We, we used to be 21 in the class. I'll write 19, 20. I'll write all of them in the night. I'll write the same letter. I'll repeat the same thing and write their names on top of it and I'll say, Lord, please, let this thing mean something to these people and I'm so amazed at what God used those things to do. I don't know what God may be giving you as an inspiration to shine as light, but I tell you, surely he will give you strategies. He will give you inspiration and you will be glad you did. You, he will fill you with his joy. He will fill you with this joy. Oh my God. I want you to try it and see what God will do. And I'm trusting the Lord that he will take you by the hand and that will be an adventure with you and him in the name of Jesus. Can I pray for you? You want to say, Father, fill me with your fire. Fill me with your zeal again. Fill me with what it takes to shine as light. I want to pray, Abba Father, for those that are listening to me right now. You can say after me, say, Lord Jesus, I receive the grace to shine as light for you and I ask you today in the name of Jesus whatever it takes oh God I ask that I receive the grace say father forgive me for any area I have compromised as a child of God I come back today and I ask that you give me the grace to go back to the same places and shine out as light in the name of Jesus receive that grace today we want to lift somebody to Christ you want to say Lord Jesus I'm a sinner I am not at peace with you I, I really want to i really want to come to the point where i i i my my sins are washed away so that all this guilt all this condemnation somebody you are having the spirit of guilt he, he, the enemy is 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 using is using the guilt of what you have done to weigh you down and the lord wants to wash you and cleanse you yes just give your life to christ The Bible says, if you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, say, thou shalt be saved. And I want to pray for you. Just say after me, say, Lord Jesus, I believe you died for me. I believe you are the son of God. You died to deliver me from my sin. I accept you as my Lord and my Savior. And today, I say no to the ways of the devil. Any covenant I have with the devil, I say it is broken. I receive the power to live as a child of God. If you pray that prayer, the Lord will be there to lay hold on you.